You know, looking out there in the World Wide Web, it's easy to feel like a little fish in an insanely gigantic ocean. I mean, how do you make new business contacts? Make yourself heard, you know, get yourself out there. Well, today we're gonna explore that as we look at social networking in the business world on The Smart Show. Okay, so we're here with Rob Getchman, and he's from LinkedIn. Rob, right off the bat, tell us how is LinkedIn different from the other social networking sites? Well, LinkedIn is unique in that it is the, it is the world's largest professional network. And LinkedIn struck on the notion that we need to have a um, great business utility to realize not only who we know, but who they know, and who those people know, and how can we tap sort of the aggregate uh, wisdom of our network and, and actively use that. And so that's, that's where the notion came out of. Let's talk about the motto, relationships matter. What does that mean exactly? Relationships matter is the motto of LinkedIn that reflects that over the course of your career, you have an inherent value developed by the relationships that you build. Everywhere you've gone, you've established relationships with people who can vouch for you, and all that you work for in your career develops a reputation that is embodied in your relationships. So relationships matter because the relationships are the things that can make your career take off. Staying in touch on the road can be complicated, not to mention expensive. There's long distance fees, cell phone roaming charges, not to mention the fact you can't see the person you're talking to. This looks like a good place for a smart tip. Smart tip! Now, instant messaging isn't just for kids anymore. Businesses across the globe are embracing I am in the workplace as a non-intrusive way to answer quick questions and clarifications, coordinate and schedule tasks, and keep employees in the know wherever they are in the world. Skype is a service that integrates instant messaging with teleconferencing. You can get an account to make calls to landlines and cell phones in the US for $3 a month and for $10 anywhere in the world. This service is available on Mac, PC, cell phones, PDAs, and even on the Sony PSP. Now, most laptops you buy today are gonna have a built-in camera, but even if they don't, almost any camera model you can buy is plug and play. And the beauty about communicating over the internet is that it's free. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm about to get a call from a very classy lady. Oh, hey, Mom. The latest experiment in workplace design combines social networking with the temporary office, and the mad scientist behind this mashup is Jerome Chung. Let's meet him. Jerome. Hi, how you doing? What's up, man? I'm good, I'm excited to hear about blank spaces. So tell us what it is. What is this, this business model? We are LA's largest co-working space, and co-working is, uh, is a shared office space, but the focus is on community and collaboration. Okay. Our philosophy here is to provide as many of the tools that you need for your office space. We do all the infrastructure. So from printer, phone, fax, mail, including receiving packages, uh, all the way to uh, Wi-Fi connections and instant community. So all you have to do is just show up and do some work. How is this a mashup between the temporary office and the social networking site? We're basically the offline equivalent of a Facebook, for example, or LinkedIn.com. People come in here, they're all separate groups, but because they're working adjacent to each other or they might meet each other at the copier, there's people who are collaborating on you know, a project for an hour, project for a day. In fact, people are hiring each other in here so that you can get a job just by setting yourself up. We have this uh, communal work bar so that you might be sitting next to a prospective client or a collaborator right next to you. This is in the center of all the space. It allows you to be you know, front and center. So there you have it. Cutting edge businesses like Blank Spaces are providing a combination of new school co-working environments with old school social networking. A little something I like to call meeting new people. Something we could all try. See you next time on The Smart Show.